when you're on the hunt after waifus, you end up sometimes smelling like you sound, and you get lost in a crowd. So you end up hungry like the wolf, and this is exactly where you fall upon Grey Wolf from Camelot France, which is the best anime of the season 2017. And like I know, she's a wolf, and um, but you know what can I say? Like I'm known for liking animals, animal girls. I mean, look at all the first waifus of every season. It's I know my, I know my stuff. I uh, I know my things, and to be honest, I think I think Grey Wolf is probably the best character of Camelot Friends. She's she's pretty. She's she looks so serious, and she looks so much smarter than anyone else. And you will see why. I uh, I think she's super cool. She she yeah. I will explain everything to you soon. Soon enough, you will see. She she's just she's the greatest character among a few others, but she's the best one. So Grey Wolf lives in a hotel with her friends, this bird and giraffe gun, and giraffe is like her biggest fan, and she and she she loves following. Giraffes love following a wolf, and wolf likes to tease giraffe in any kind of way she can. Like sh she might even have lesbians feelings for her, and she she loves to seduce and play with her. But in the end, it's just to give her an autograph because she really likes to sign and draw fan art of her. But it's because she likes people. She likes hanging out with people. She liked Serval and Caban. And once they were gone from that episode, I, I'm sure she thinks about them. She, she, they're a good part of her inspiration in life. She draws dudgeons of, of them, and who doesn't? Like everyone does, fan art of Serval and Caban. But as you might have noticed, the Grey Wolf is an artist. She likes to draw. She's a mangaka, and she's very good at it. She, she's very. She, she thinks about what she draws, about even what she writes. She she's good at it. She's the best. She, she seriously and the the place where she is, it's perfect for that. She's very. I think the term is meticulous. She knows what she's doing and she's always hanging like on the table, always looking proud of herself. And this is what she draws. She draws very good. That's only a storyboard art. And she can draw the best kind of art, like this. Dick Butt is the best. But she's not feeling it. She's not always good with all of the fan, all of the people, because her eye son is kind of not the good person you want to have with you. So she has to uh, remedy to this situation with a tablet, like every good artist. But what does she do when she doesn't have the, in the inspiration to to draw? Well, she tells scary stories, detectives, scary detective stories. She's good at it. She likes to tell horror stories. She does respect the, the term crying like cry wolf. She, she's always in, lurking in the darkness about to spook people. But when there's light in the darkness, then you might notice that w what what lights in the darkness mean it's the moon the full moon she's a wolf so uh, on the full moon she she gets unleashed like the gray wolf werewolf that she is and this is where she she releases her inner beast because even though she's always full beast and she's a badass she's f strong She's powerful. She can kill any several ends as fast as a power drill. Because she's always keeping her her inner wolf beside her. It's always with her. When she's howling like the wolf, she, she's pulling it out of her lungs. She's really good at it. It's basically her stand. It's basically, yeah. 
and she's mature like a wolf. But you know, there's more than just that in life. Being mature and serious is not always fun. You gotta see life through different angles, especially as an artist, like she is. And drawing is not like when you don't find the inspiration. You can just put your works aside and just sit, just relax, be yourself, like just contemplate life and you can do good. Maybe sometimes write notes about what you're about every every day's life, read a book to find more inspiration or just drink a cup of coffee. It's always there there's so many things you can do to relax. And I personally I'm a f not a good connoisseur of coffee, but I like coffee. And sometimes just take a cup of coffee with your loved ones and hold hands with them. And feel love, like tease each other and have warm feelings and be happy as you're with the one you love. No wonder I'm angry like the wolf sometimes.